Hello and welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Super Carlin Gaming Pokemon Soul Silver Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge, where today we are indeed up for a challenge because we are at the Elite Four. It is, I am, I am genuinely nervous. This is gonna be uh, some uh, potentially very, very difficult fights. It's like there's almost no way at least one of them doesn't throw out some big scary legendary at us at some point, you know what I mean? Like, it's gonna happen. Um, the question I'm sure you're wondering about is how are we handling the level cap for Yield Elite Four here, okay? So, and it's a great question. Uh, the answer to which is that I am going to count the fourth member of the Elite Four as the next, their highest level Pokemon as the next level cap. Uh, because, uh, um, let me just pull up the, what they all, what they all look like here. So, that means the fourth member is Karen. Her strongest Pokemon is level 47. So, the reason I'm doing that is because I'm, like, it be it's it doesn't seem like they're all one unit, right? And you can't go in between them. It's all basically one fight, uh, other than you can heal in between them. But since you can't like uh, you know go train anymore in between them, uh, that's how I'm gonna handle it. I've, I looked up to see how other people handled this. This seemed to be like a popular way to do it. The the way that's nice is that otherwise the problem is if you want to treat it as Lance, at, or the champion, as the next one, then it goes all the way up to 50, which means you're pretty over-leveled for, like, everything else, especially because you'll keep leveling up as you go. Um, the problem is if you just treat it as the very first member, like, oh, well, that's the next one, that's the stop, then it's only at 44, so you're pretty just sort of, like, under-leveled, so that's how I'm doing it anyway. And it doesn't really matter, because here's what I'm actually going to do, is I'm going to go grind, and I think I'm going to try and get everyone to 45 so we have room to grow whilst we fight uh, our way through. And gosh, it, uh, bear in mind, I'm looking at it right now, the lowest level thing we will be fighting today is uh, Koga, oh no, oops, sorry. Yeah, is level 40. And that's, uh, we'll fight two level 40s. And that's Will's first Pokemon and Koga's first Pokemon. Doesn't matter. They're all going to qualify for the level 40 rule, which means every single Pokemon we fight today will be fully evolved. If it can fully evolve, it's going to be it's going to be kind of scary. I will say off camera, I went and found a new TM. Uh, that I it was just a lot of like switching around and stuff. Uh, wait, hold on, hold on. I got to do two. Uh, I had to go get Nora out of the box again to go get said TM. So we'll switch Nora off one more time. But the TM was, wait for it, da, 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 Dragon Claw here. Yeah, let's get Dragon Claw out. Boom, we are definitely gonna give this to Kimberlina for sure. Uh, yeah. And the move we're gonna get rid of, I think, is just gonna be Dragon Breath. Because whilst Dragon Breath is a solid 60 power special attack that might uh, do paralysis, you can see that our special attack is not nearly as high as our physical attack, and this is an 80 power physical attack, so it is just way better in every way. So not only are we getting a power boost uh, from 60 to 80, but also we're going from 106 to 137 on the uh, stat we're using. So sorry, Dragon's Breath, it's going away. We no longer need to breathe. We're no longer just gonna breathe on stuff. We are instead going to claw stuff. Uh, so that's very good. I think that's going to be a very uh, useful addition to the team right there. I'm going to go grab Plant out of the box real quick right here, right here, right now. Uh, Ba-boom. Yep. Let's move Pokemon. Let's get Plant. Right there. There it is. And uh, with that, I think we are going to... Oh, gosh. What happened? What happened? We're going to... Okay. We're going to save so nothing goes crazy here. And we might have to restart because Dialga is afraid. We also do that. Save game state. All right, I'll be right back. Hold on. All right, we're back. Plant is there. All right, I'm going to go do some grinding. I'm going to try and get everyone up to level 45, and then we are going to take on the Elite Four. Oh my gosh, I am I am so nervous. Even I'm like, I don't want to lose any. We've lost so many Pokemon. I don't want to lose anymore. I just don't want to. 
Oh, uh, here we go. Anyway, oh, we're off to a great start. It's Zapdos. Oh my gosh. Uh, let's see how that Dragon Claw does. Am I right? Could oh, not quite dead. All right, well, it's, it's, it's a wonderful start. Uh, ancient power. Okay, bad start. Bad start. But we we beat it anyway. <laughs> All right, for real though, now I'm gonna go start grinding and uh, enjoy the music. I will see you in a minute. This might take a minute for me, but it's gonna be just a, a lovely dance session for you. All right, see you in a second. Enjoy the music. Gosh, you guys, we finally got to 45 on everyone. We're gonna, we're also gonna go ahead and do this, right? We've got, let's get like five more. Why not, right? Just be, why not? There's really no reason not to have maximum full, I mean, I could get even more, I suppose. Um, I'm gonna get some more full heals too, just in case, right? We're gonna get, let's get, let's get like seven more. There we go. I don't even feel like that was enough full restores, because between fights, who's to say how many we might need? Oh, we don't have that much money. Okay, so maybe we can serve some money. We're gonna go in. Hey, that's, you know what? That's good. That's, we're gonna go with that. We're gonna go with that. I don't know if there are any like nuggets or anything. Oh, I can tell you what we can sell right here. We can sell this iron. Yeah, that's money right there. This calcium, that's some money. Yeah, get out of here. PP up, not bad, not bad. Let me tell you, during that grind, there was some serious annoyance going on. Ooh, I have a, a rare candy, that's fantastic. Max revive, go ahead and sell that. Don't need that at all. Revive, go ahead and sell that. Wish we could use it, but we can't. Uh, proteins, yeah, we don't know, just go ahead and get rid of those. Yep, that's some money right there. Look, we're just turning stuff into money, it's fantastic. PP up might be good. So, yeah, there was a bunch of, fortunately, there was a ton of mill tank in the victory road that we were able to grind on like seriously. And that was very nice. They gave a whopping 900 XP. So that was super helpful to the grind. There's also the occasional tan growth offering up some seriously juicy 1000 XP. Those are a little bit rare. Um, but really annoying was there's freaking tons of Zapdoses out there. And they had the ability pressure which makes every time you use a move, it uses two PP instead of just one. And then they would use detect and just spam it. And so you'd end like, oh, you just like waste a ton of PP. So low PP moves, just, just oh, it took forever. Especially, let me tell you who had a hard time out there was Plant. Plant is feeling the frustration of being unevolved. You know, it's like more than ever, not only has Plant just been, you know, boxed for Nora a couple times. He's coming out here. He's got to deal with, like, the, the literal god of Pokemon. Ice and Kimberly, who are fully evolved. Noelle, who's fully evolved. Everyone else feels like they're reaching their full potential, and Plant is just there like, ah! And then he, you can just see the frustration as they were training. He kept running into coughings. They kept self-destructing. It was very annoying. We, yeah. Anyway, the only real, that said, that said, the only real new move we got was Dig on Plant. So we got rid of Sand's attack. Um, nothing new on Ace. Ace tried to learn extreme speed again. That was funny. Of course, we just kept hyper voice instead. Um, we had to do some, the mill tanks were all using bide, which was a scary move, but we found a fantastic tactic for that, which was um, just you turning out through Tana and then protecting with Noel. There's that lovely fart sound. Oh my goodness. Uh, Ice had a great, Ice on the other hand, had the complete opposite training session of Plant, where Plant kept running into really frustrating Pokemon. Ice was just like hunting down the mill tanks, was just like, you, 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 just flew up in the level. Well done, well done to Ice. Uh, so we, we really, I mean, I feel bad for Plant because there's not much we can do. And he's still just a little ways off from evolving, just a little ways off. I think it's, I want to say it's 50, maybe it's 55 though. It is, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna check. Hold on, let's, let's do a quick check here. Uh, Hold on, you probably just lost the music. That's a really abrupt change. Da, 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 
Oh, it's 48. Okay, so we are actually exceptionally close to evolving um, Mighty Plant. We are 48. So you know what? If we get to 47 during the Elite Four, I think we have one rare candy left. We will use it on Plant, and uh, I will I will let Plant rain his Garchompiness down, and it will be fantastic. Uh, hold on here. Let me get back to the screen I was on. Over here. Sorry, I keep clicking off the game. I want to make sure I have the, the Elite Four pulled up here. Of course, what Pokemon they have is not important. I want to know whether or not we are fighting their ace Pokemon at any given moment. Oh my gosh. All of them, just as, just as one final reminder, they will all be all fully evolved. They are going to be dangerous. It is going to be tough stuff. We have no idea what they're going to have. We cannot prepare in that way. We're going to lead, I think, with Miss Kimberly, uh, just for the very, for the, for the Intimidate. That's what we're going with. Um, man, oh mayonnaise, y'all. It is, I'm, I am nervous. I am nervous to go in because we have, it's just, there's nothing we can do. It's just, it's five fights in a row. Win or die, you know, <laughs> it's just going to be, it is very nerve wracking. We've got to... We're gonna have to play very strategically. We have to lean on each other. Do not over, do not be overcome. We've, I, this has been my weakness the whole game is just like assuming our strong Pokemon can handle anything because they're strong. And whilst I believe most of the time they could have handled it, that has also led us to situations where we were not in the optimal situation. It's not like, it's not like Megan couldn't have defeated that Gligar. It's that other, it's that Emberg would have been even better suited. So we have to just play, try and play optimally. We have to bear it all in mind. Oh my gosh, I'm so nervous. There's always the Noel. There's Noel for Toxic Stall with the headbutt. Oh gosh, it's just, I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. Oh gosh. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. I think we're gonna go ahead and head in. This is it. Destiny awaits, so are you ready, Kim? Kimberly is concentrating. Me too. Once you enter the store, you will be facing one of the Elite Four. They are really tough. You cannot exit once you enter. Yeah, I got it. I got it. Oh my gosh, I'm so nervous. Are you ready? Be courageous and go for it. All right, thank you, doorman. Thank you for your final words of confidence. Ugh. Oh my gosh, here we go. Oh, what are they gonna have? They could be, it could be, it could be so bad. This guy typically has psychic types. Who knows what he's gonna have this time? Welcome to the, oh, what did I just do? No. My headphones, that was a, such a bad moment. Stop it! Stop playing the music! No! My headphones do this weird thing where I like tap them, it like opens iTunes and just starts playing. It's always stuck on Speechless from the new Aladdin movie, which is a great song, but I just don't want to keep hearing it at random. Anyway, allow me to introduce myself. I am Will. I have trained all around the world, making my psychic type Pokemon powerful. And at last, I've been accepted into, please don't have like, Please don't actually have psychic Pokemon. By which, I, you know what I really am saying is please don't have Mewtwo. Please don't have Mewtwo. Gosh, here we go. We're in it. We're in it to win it. Ah! Game on, dude. All right, they're all going to be, they're all going to be fully evolved. We are going to have, this is five tough Pokemon in a row, and he leads with Deoxys. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Cuts the toxic attack. Okay, we cut the attack, so that's something. We are immediately switching. I think Noel is the correct option. This is this. They are not messing around. Elite Four, indeed. Remember last time when Lorelei had four Aeron? We are. It is different. It is different. Noel can get around Deoxys' psychic types because we are dark type. Um, here we go. Bring the nightshade. You got nothing. You've got nothing. Here's what we're gonna do. Let's see how. Night Slash does. Knock off. Oh no! Knock off to the leftovers. That is bad news. But we got it! One shot, Noel wrecks Deoxys, but we will not get the leftovers heal, which is a real bummer. Infernape! Oh no! Not Infernape! Oh, Infernape who killed Empoleon! No, but okay, you know what we know? We know what we know. We know that Kimberly resists both fighting and fire type moves and can throw an intimidate and that it's a physical pokemon so bring it on bro get ready for the intimidate oh yeah punishment what is that i don't even know what that move is it did nothing it makes no difference we fly high 
punishment again. Oh no, we missed! Okay, okay, it's okay. Just get the jitters out, Kim. We fly high. It can miss, it can miss. We have like, it's like 95%. We rain death from the sky! Oh, it's a crit and the crit. See, we missed one. Kim came in with the second one. It was like, I got this. Boom, hit him right in the weak spot. There we go. One, one, two. That's the only two. Oh my gosh, it's Kyogre! Ah! I don't like that one bit! And the rain is coming. Okay, I kind of think that... Okay, let's see. I kind of think Noelle is the right choice again here because... Well, we do resist. We resist with Kimberly right now. Noel could toxic. Gosh, this is this guy has had Deoxys and Kyogre. Oh my gosh, can you even believe it? I'm really afraid of like a hydro pump is what I'm genuinely afraid of. But to that end, we do resist um, water, but still hydro pump in the rain. Oh, it is dangerous. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. It's not. It's very, that's very scary. Oh, this is a tough, this is tough to get around. Now, this is why if we could, if we could get to Noel, I would feel a lot better because we could just toxic it and then we could just stall it. Um, we could also potentially switch to, let's, oh man, Kimberly, 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 Kimberly. Oh gosh. Now, even that tiny little bit of health we're missing, it's making me so nervous. Like, gosh, that seems like that's enough to make the difference right there. Oh, should we fly? Should we fly? I don't think fly will kill it. That's for sure. That's definitely not going to happen. We're going to have to, but we can at least sort of scout what it's got. Okay, we're going for the fly. Blew up high. Ice beam. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Oh, go, 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 go. Oh, but what does it have? What is it doing? Is this the ace? His ace is Kyogre, and he's got to, but we have a Yachi Berry. We should. Yes, okay, the Yachi Berry has finally come into effect. Weakened the power. Oh no. <gasps> oh God. Oh, it was so dangerous. It was so, okay, it's gonna try an Ice Beam again. Right, that much is almost certain. So I think we can switch to Noel here because I think we can take an Ice Beam Noel, but gosh, I wish. The Yachi Berry just saved us. The Yachi Berry saved us. We could also just go to Ace. I think maybe Ace is the move here because Noel has taken us some damage and I don't like that. I think Ace can take whatever this thing wants to dole out. We can just like hyper voice. Let's go. Okay, we're gonna bring in our Ace for his Ace. There's the Ice Beam again. Don't freeze us, that would be bad. Okay, rain continues to fall. We actually have Surf, so that benefits from the rain, but that doesn't make much of a difference. We're gonna go Hyper Voice. Now, this would be dangerous because it could use something like, oh no, oh, it goes Aqua Ring. So it's gonna try and heal, but it's gonna get a little back, but I don't think that's enough. It might be, it might have been a little bit of enough. We're gonna go Hyper Voice again. Oh, we got it. Oh, yes, Ace. Oh, goodness, that was scary. Empoleon! <gasps> no! No, you bring Empoleon to fight us? No! How dare thee! How dare thee! Okay, it's got, it's steel though, so it is weak to ground. Oh gosh. It does have the water boost though. Um, I think we just go with the earth power. This guy. Haunting us. Oh no, of course, Empoleon holds on. His special defense fell. Brian. <gasps> oh my gosh, that was horrifying. That was not cool because Brian does double damage if they are under if they are under half health, which they are, and it's raining. That is how powerful Ace is right there. I think we heal. I think they're gonna heal, and I think we're gonna heal. Let's go. Full restore, man. We do not need that nonsense. They're gonna heal too, yeah, I thought so. Okay, but we had taken a little bit of damage before that. We're gonna go with another Earth Power. They're probably just gonna do it again though. They're just gonna brine again. Oh, we got the crit! Oh, why, did, why was it so much more effective that time? 
Was that Max Min? I, it can't have been. It was insanely different. Why didn't it kill it the first time? I'm so confused. Oh, because the first one lowered its special defense. That's what happened. Okay, I was like, what is that? Why was that so much better? Okay, I'm glad we healed. I'm glad we healed. This thing is going down. We're going to just hyper voice it, I think. Hyper voice, come on. Mmm! And Razor Leaf, that's gonna do nothing. Yeah, we just laugh that off. Okay. And then we're just gonna drag and pulse into the wind. Oh, he's gonna restore. Okay. Okay, well, I think I'm just gonna drag and pulse again. We'll save our hyper voices. Is that it? Is that five? Did we get him? One down? Oh. I can't believe this. Let's recap. Deoxys, Kyogre, Infernate, Empoleon, and Leafeon. Oh my gosh. That was, that was so scary. That was so scary. Oh my gosh, that was nuts. Where is the full restore? Use it on Kimberlina right now. And do I have anything that are just like a little bit, maybe not hyper potion? I have the... One potion there. I'm just gonna use just the hyper potion here on Noel there, and then we'll use that tiny little potion over here. Just think, just the to top off. Oh no, what? Just to um, top off Ace. Okay. Oh my gosh, <sighs> that was insane, insane in the membrane, you guys. That was only the first one. I mean, he had Deoxys as his lead. Can you believe that? I can't believe it. That was bananas. Okay though, bananas or not, we made it. We head on to Koga. No one died. I am Koga of the Elite Four. I live in shadows, a ninja. My intricate style will confound and destroy you. Confusion, sleep, poison. Prepare to be the victim of my sinister techniques. <laughs> Pokemon are not merely about brute force. You shall see soon enough. Here we go. Cloyster! Okay, so he's leading with an... <gasps> we didn't replace the Yachi Berry. We have to remember that. That is dangerous. I cannot believe I... Okay. That's, that's something to be aware of. I think we have more Yachi Berries. I forgot to replace it. That's bad news. We are immediately in a position of danger, which I don't like. Here's what we're gonna do. I think it's just water ice, right? It's just water ice, that's all it is. Okay, so I think maybe we go to Noel here. Now, in case you're wondering, knockoff doesn't like make you lose. Yeah, he went for the Aurora Beam, it's smartly, right? We're gonna go for the toxic here. Yeah. He goes spikes. Oh, dangerous. Okay. Does let us heal, but I don't like that. And now here's what we're going to... He could keep going spikes, which would be very bad, because every time you switch, um, you take damage. And typically, that's not a problem with Pokemon trainers in the game, because they um, only have one type all the time, and they're rare, and you're rarely switching. But this is again, this is the first Pokemon he's had, so that spikes could add up because we might have to switch a lot. Uh, flying types won't be affected by it. We're gonna protect here. What I'm afraid of is he's gonna you can lay down more and more layers of spikes, and that would be bad. So I'm gonna headbutt. We're gonna hope we get the splint. Ah, uh, there's two rounds of spikes. Ugh, I don't like that at all. And now we're going to protect again. And now we're gonna go for the kill butt. Yeah. <gasps> Yeah, there it is. Boom. One down. Cloister down. Our lovely Noel has taken. And a Moltres! Oh, we're facing all of our worst enemies at once. All of our worst enemies are coming back to fight us here. Okay, so let's see. Noel should be okay here. Let's at least go toxic again. Flamethrower up. Hit us with the very move we gave up on learning. Oh gosh, that was pretty rough. And we took the burn there, which I do not like, not one bit. Um, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna protect for a turn. Let the poison build up. Why not? There we go. Then we heal, the burn hits us, which is okay, because what we're gonna do 
is go full restore. That will at least heal off the burn. There you go. Flamethrower. Wow. It hit us, but we are going to heal. And then what we're going to do here, ready? We're just going to go for another protect. And then we'll get some leftover damage and the poison will continue. Oh, it failed. Oh, no. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay. So now what we're going to do is so witch. I think we're going to go into Kimberly here. That was maybe not the best move. Man. I thought, I think... I thought using the full restore would make the protect reset, but it did not. So you can't typically use protect twice in a row. You have like a like a coin, not a coin flip. I think it's like a 25% chance of the work the second time. So obviously we didn't win that one. And that was very dangerous. And I feel dumb for having let that even happen. Um, so Rutana and Kimberly can switch in without having to fear the spike damage. Because the, the Rutana has levitate and Kimberly is flying. So that's that. Um, Kimberly resists though, so we're gonna go to Kim. Cuts the attack. Thrower. We resist it. Not very effective. Hit by poison. Now is where it's dangerous though, because I bet he goes ahead and does the full restore, which I'm not gonna like, not one bit. Which means we could, if we wanted, to try and use like an X item. I don't think we have many of those, do we? Maybe we should just check. We don't have X attack. Oh, we do have X attack, so we could like X attack right here, if we wanted. We could also full restore Noel, cause he's definitely gonna full restore. Or we could just get in the free attack, which is, I think is the smarter thing. Cause then we're probably faster anyway. And if he doesn't, then he's gonna die to poison. So let's go for the dragon claw. Yeah, he's going for the full restore. We're gonna go for the dragon claw. And we're gonna go for another dragon claw. And just like that, we get the win. Okay, it's three left. Frost last. Oh gosh, we are switching immediately. I think this is Ice's time to shine. Right? Yeah. Let's go. Let's go, Ice. Hurt by the spikes. See what I mean? You don't want the spikes. The spike damage hits us on the incoming, but we have leftovers, so that's good. Um, let's just hit it with the lava plume. Wake up, slap. No, we're not asleep, so that's okay. Lava Plume should wreck this thing. Excellent, excellent. Well done, Ice. <sighs> and his Say Limits. He has a Say Limits as well. Oh, goodness. Oh, my goodness, my gracious. Okay. Okay, so here's... It's dangerous. But we have Ace, and Ace has Dragon Pulse. So I think that's the move here, because it shouldn't have, like... Um, let's go to Ace. We're going to take some Spikes damage, which is a bummer. The Zen Headbutt. Also a little bit of damage, but not too bad. Now we can just Dragon Pulse it, and this should hurt it quite a bit, because it's weak to Dragon. So let's see, how does Ace fare? Go, 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 go. Oh, it's scary facing us. The question is, is he going to go for the um, full restore here, or is he done on that front? He went for the Protect, so he's just gonna try and stall us out. So he's not gonna full restore, so we are just gonna, oh. Don't flinch us. He's going for the old protect and flinch strategy. Mm, and it's working thus far. Zen headbutt, don't flinch us. Flinch! Oh gosh, okay. Well, that's okay. We're not gonna be, we don't actually need to use that one. We can go for the hyper potion instead. There we go. Now we don't have to waste our uh, potential status saving. Okay, so now I think we've got it. He's going for the headbutt. He missed. The Dragon Pulse should do it. Man, they have had good Pokemon. They have had good Pokemon so far. It has been, it has been not deadly, but scary. Oh, slacking. Ugh. Okay. Okay. Um. Okay. This is this is doable. This is doable. We can do this because we have protect. Right. So. Um, let's go. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to use Hyper Potion on Noel right now. Okay. So swagger. Okay, we're not a, we're not concerned. Because now he's going to be slacking off, right? So we, we come out here, and now he's slacking off. We hit the spikes. No big deal. He's loafing around. And on this turn, he's going to try... Now, I think slacking has an ability that stops him from being hit with like status moves is that right i 
thing. So maybe the toxic isn't the way to go, but here's what we can do. It just hit protect, right? Boom. And now, oh, I don't even see what he used, but obviously he didn't hit us. So, toxic? Okay. Hurt by poison, right? And now he's stuck, right? No, well, he's protect. <laughs> Protected itself. Covet. Protected itself. Hurt by poison. Now watch this. And now he's loafing around. Night slash. So we don't have to worry about him hitting us. Critical hit. Don't know what he's got there. Citrus berry. Doesn't matter. And now we protect. <laughs> so he's stuck. Uh, yeah. Oof. Oof is right on your front, because that's pretty much it. There we go. We got him. Right? Noel? You're insane. Oh! Yeah! If you have Protect, you can always beat Slacking, because you can always Protect on the turn when they're not loafing around. <laughs> that was pretty good. I subjected you to everything I could muster, but my efforts fail. I must own my skills. Go on to the next room. Okay, so a couple things we got to do. First is we're going to use the ether on protect. If you have restored, excellent. Uh, and then we're going to use our hyper potion on ice. And then, oh God, oh, we need to put another, do I have another Yachi Berry? Yeah. Give to Kimberly. And then let's see. Do we have like a... No, I was gonna say, do we have like a Orin Berry or something? I, I'm hesitant to use another Hyper Potion just yet, but I'm also hesitant to not heal Kimberly, you know? Like, is it, let's just do it, whatever. Okay, we did it, now it's there. All right, see you later, Kogs. You had some scary stuff. You're slacking, not too bad, but uh, you know, we were ready. We had protect, and that's all we needed in the end. So, yeah. All right, the next highest thing we have to face is a level 46 here against B Runo. Oh boy. All right. They have had such good Pokemon so far. I always train to the extreme because I believe in our potential. That is how we become strong. Can you withstand our power? <laughs> I see no fear in you. You look determined. Perfect for battle. Ready, Jay? You will bow down to our overwhelming power. <laughs>
because uh, they're just going to hit us with more of this annoying accuracy stuff. Um, but we can at least take advantage of the rain with Ace. Muddy water, please don't continue with the ac- Oh man, that accuracy. That's rough, but we can surf back now. Oh! Hidden power what? Super effective! That means it's hidden power fighting. That is so not cool. That is so not cool. Man, this Gastrodon is giving us some serious problems. Okay, we need to switch. They're gonna full restore for sure, so we're gonna go to Noel here. Oh no, why did I do this? This was such a bad move. Let's see, let's protect and just see what they go for. Rain dance, oh gosh, we brought the rain back. I'm afraid they're gonna go for like a earthquake or something, you know? Because they might've just been doing that for the setup. Let's go to Rutana. Muddy water. The accuracy, oh my gosh, it's insane. This thing is giving me serious problems. Well, the, I mean, I guess Kimberly's actually doing pretty good. It's just that the accuracy loss was the problem. Kimberly's still the correct answer. I should, have, I should not have switched to Noel. That was just a bad move. Um, let's go Kimberly. It has rain dance, muddy water. The accuracy loss is what's really killing me here. Let's go for fly. Stall out of turn on the water. Rain continues to fall. Let me go for that. Avoided the attack, rain stopped. Okay, so now the muddy water is not as dangerous. Now we can drag and claw this thing, kill it. Thank goodness, man. Kill it with fire, all right? Jeez. We, oh, oh, I'm going to 46. Yay. Everyone gets experience. Polychode. Okay. God, this is more water stuff. Going against the old rain dance team. I'm surprised this thing didn't just start up with the drizzle. Okay, so. The good news is we resist the water, but the bad news is that we have taken some serious damage, and I don't like it. So we're gonna do that and just see what they've got. Swagger! Okay, that's no good. I don't like that. Not a huge deal. We can still go to Noel now, because now we don't have to feel the ground type moves. So let's do that. Parish Song! Oh no. Um, okay, it's not. We have a turn though. So let's just. It's definitely gonna try and switch out, is what's gonna happen. Um. Go for the toxic though. It sprang up. Bounce. One. Now we're obviously going to switch. And what we're going to switch into is Kimberly again. For the intimidate. Yeah, obviously. Obvi well, he obviously went for the intimidate as well. <laughs> or he went for the. Uh, did he get intimidated? He had to go, he had the pair song, so I knew he was gonna do that. Now we have the advantage though, because now we can Zen Headbutt and get rid of this Arbok. We'll see if we can get it in one shot. I kinda don't think we will. Yeah. This is his ace, okay. And it flinched though, so actually I think we will get it on the second shot. Maybe we can get it, all right, let's see. Can we get it? Can we get it? Oh, almost. These gastros. What? what does that do? What did that just do? I always miss what it says. Okay, he's definitely gonna go for another um, full restore here though. So let's, let's just Zen Headbutt again. Oh, he's out of medicine. That's good to know. Okay, excellent. We're gonna level up. That's good. Kimberly for the Winberly. <sighs> Polychoed, he's still got how many Pokemon? Oh my gosh, this is so nerve wracking. Let's go with the, uh, we want this thing dead. I don't want it to perish song me again. It's so annoying. Um, maybe I can get it to flinch or maybe we can, we just gotta put damage on it. We got a dragon claw, perish song. Yeah, I thought so. I had a feeling. So if we can headbutt it, well, let's see if we can get him to flinch. 
Oh, no, it didn't. Alright. Think we can go into Noel here. Uh, bounce is annoying because it can just paralyze you, and I don't like that at all. Um, switch to Noel again. Bounce. Please don't paralyze me. Yeah, I thought so. So he's definitely going to switch, right? That's what's going to happen. And so are we. We're going to switch too. We're going to intimidate whatever comes in. Cuts Noel, it doesn't matter, because we bring in the, we intimidate. That's right. The Parish Song. Oh, it's so annoying, it's so scary. It's like, ah, uh, make sure you get around it. I wish we'd poisoned it earlier. Um, so we resist fire, that's good. Let's go for the Dragon Claw. Extreme speed, uh, it's dangerous. Arcanines, they're known for it. Okay, that was pretty solid though. Um, let's go for the Dragon Claw. Extreme speed, yep. Now, okay. oh gosh, it's so close, it's so close. So he's gonna do it again. Right, um, probably. I'm gonna conserve the Dragon Claws and just go for the uh, strength here. Gosh, we took some serious damage there. And Politoed. So it's probably gonna Perish Song, which is a dumb move, but we're just gonna Dragon Claw it to death. Yeah, and, it, and we win. Oh, it has one more. It has the nine tails. Okay. So we already resist. We have taken some damage though, which I don't like. Um, we could go. We could go to ice, right? That would be. We're definitely not gonna. We can go to plant, honestly, because we resist there and we have the ground type. Thing. Let's go to plant. It's just because we have more health, quick attack, and we have the leftovers. And we go dig, safeguard, not a concern. We stall out one turn of it anyway right here. We get the leftovers, it misses, we dig. Oh, it's so close. It's so close. Okay, we're just gonna go for the slash for the win. Oh, we used the full restore. Okay, well, now we dig. Oh no, this is bad. All right, come on plant, focus. Focus underground. Hurt itself in its confusion. It's okay. We can stall out the... He really just can't even... Now he's really screwed. Okay, here we go. Plant. Restored health. Confusion. Miss. Dig. Plant for the win. <laughs> what a perfect move Dig is for a Pokemon named Plant. Woo! All right. Having lost, I have no right to say anything. Go face your next challenge. Three down. Oh my gosh, these guys, they're they're stressing me out. Big time. Full restore. Let's go. Definitely on ace. Use it on Kimberly. Use it on Rutana. I feel like we're just gonna use a full heal on Noel, and I think we're probably good on plant as well because I want to conserve those full restores just in case but both of these guys have leftovers you can protect and heal and you can dig and heal so they both have options in that regard Whew. Um, my only other thought is whether or not we should do we have another ether um, okay. We've my only other thought is that we've used a lot of dragon claws. Right? We've used we've got only four. Okay, so that makes me nervous that we might need four in the next fight, just because they've been pretty bulky. I think I'm just gonna I mean, why wait? This is the moment. The moment is now. What are we saving it for? Max Ether? Let's go, Kimberly, Dragon Claw. PP restored, here we go. Boy, oh, and here, this is a bad omen. I don't really particularly like this. No, I don't, Dialga, just sort of 
rearing its ugly head at us. Let's see if we can fix it with a door. As you, oh, we can't. Okay, well that's bad news. Uh, I don't like this bad omen going right into the last fight. Nope. Well, we might have known Dialga would try something like this. Here we go. I'm Karen of the Elite Four. You are Jay. How amusing. I love dark type Pokemon. Known for my overpowering tactics. Think you can take me? Just try to entertain me. Let's go. Bring it, Karen! Karen! All right. <laughs> Celebi! All right. All right. And you get to play, all right. You get to play. She's got a mythical Pokemon. It's fine. We're good. We're not afraid. We don't fear it! Weak to its grass, so it's weak to flying. Let's go, we fly! We fly high, we rain. Oh, it's safeguards, that's pretty solid. We should remember that so we don't accidentally try and toxic it here. We rain death from the sky, just like that. Celebi dead, one down, four to go. Here we go, her ace is level 47. Look out for it, and oh! The mirror match, how dare you, how? Devi, I understand. I understand why you would try. But we have the answer. We have the answer. The answer's name is Ace. Here we go. And I'm only doing this because now our attack, uh, we're, we, we're... <laughs> our speed is lowered. Zen headbutt. Oh, this is what happened last time. It's that they were kept Zen headbutting us and flinching us. But we Dragon Pulse. Okay, so they are definitely going to uh, full restore here. So what we are going to do is battle item X special, right? Yeah. Let's do it. This is the time. Because they're gonna they're definitely gonna heal, right? Full restore? Yeah, okay, so now all we have to do is not flinch! Oh, and for the protect. Okay. Interesting. Not flinch! This should do it this time. Our attack is up. Our damage is up. Go, 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 go. We have the Dragon Claw. We have the Dragon Pulse. We have the X Special in play. It let us set up a little bit. We level up. We level up. Rhyperia, oh, how dare she? Look at this nonsense. She, they are throwing all of it at us. All of it. We have the X special, we have the four times weakness. We might not have the speed, but I think we, even with the speed drop, I think we have the speed because uh, Rhyperiors are not fast. Not that it couldn't hit us with something strong. That's what I'm concerned about. Like we could heal. Let's just see. Let's go ahead and do it. Just to be careful here. Hammer arm. <gasps> Super effective indeed. Speed fell. Now I feel very comfortable. Let's see it go all the way. Yes. Part of me was like, maybe I should have healed. Maybe I should have just gone for the surf. I obviously should have gone for the surf right out of the gate because. Um, now we're worse off. We were at 105 and now we're at 99. Well, who's to say though? I don't know if we would have been faster. I think we would have, we would have killed it. I don't think this thing can one shot us from there. But I'm nervous. It could like poison us or something. Here we go. Let's heal. I mean, look, okay, so we're stuck fighting it. All right, if you want to fight, oh no, this is bad. Uh oh. Ace is confused. Hyper voice, here we go. Hyper voice. Hyper voice. One shot, one kill. Stab, normal. Oh, you jest. You jest. That is so annoying. That is so annoying. Okay. Um, I feel like she's gonna heal, so we're gonna full heal, right? She's gonna heal, we're gonna heal. 
Erica, oh, didn't heal, but she's just going for the crits. She's going for the crits, y'all. Yeah, now we're just gonna hyper voice though. Oh, it is faster than us. Oh, because we had the speed drop. That's right. Okay. Have we seen her AC? I don't think so. I don't think so. 1900. Vile Plume. 42. You guys want to know something hilarious? Is that Karen normally has a level 42 Vile Plume. So this is actually right in keeping with um, how she typically plays. The question is, can we switch out or are we still stuck with the mean look? I think, yeah, we're good. We're gonna go into Kimberly here. Stun Spore, yeah, that's a good move, but um, also we're just gonna fly high and rain death from the sky, as usual. Bring it, do it, all the way dead, boom. Dead, ha! Oh. I don't even know what the ace was. What was the ace? I missed it entirely in our epic throwdown. Aha! Strong Pokemon, weak Pokemon. That is only the selfish perception of people. Truly skilled trainers should try to win with the Pokemon they love best. I like his style. You understand what's important. Go on. The champion is ready. We have done it, you guys. We have defiated the Elite Four, at least. And we have come through Relatively unscathed. Let me go ahead and do that. Relatively. Not perfectly, but we're doing pretty good thus far. One fight awaits. Lance. Now, we have to remember, I have no idea how the randomizer is going to handle this, but Last time he had a Star Raptor as his like big ace Pokemon. So it's possible that's what we're coming up against here. We cannot train anymore. His ace has a level 50. Other than that, he only had, he's gonna lead with a level 44 or something. Other than that, he has two level 48s and a level 49. So everything he has is going to be, everything except his lead is going to be stronger than everything on our team. That's what we're up against. And it's gonna be stronger than any, he has four Pokemon on his team that are going to be, all be stronger than any Pokemon we've faced in the entire game. I'm sorry, he has five Pokemon on his team like that. Because he has the full six. So, it's scary. <laughs> it's scary to say the least. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. Oh, uh, should we do it now? Okay. Okay. I think we can do it. I mean, what what more what more can we do? Right? What more can we do? You ready, Kim? Kim really let out a battle cry. That's what I like to see. All right. Lance the Dragon Trainer. I've got a dragon for you, bro. I've got a dragon for you. I've been waiting for you. Jay, I knew that with your skills, you would eventually reach me here. There's no need for words now. We will battle to determine who is the stronger of the two of us. As the most powerful trainer and as the Pokemon League champion, I, Lance the Dragon Master, accept your challenge. If his book, I mean, what's he got? Dusk Noir, this is the, oh, this is the easy Pokemon. Dusk Noir, Dusk Noir, all right. We can immediately go to Ace, who will resist the ghost type attacks, right? We can immediately bring that out. It's probably not a bad move. Let's see, let's resist some ghosts. Yeah, it doesn't affect Ace, that's what I thought. Now, Hyper Voice won't affect him either. Oh, Dragon Pulse is down, I did not realize that. 
That's a bummer. We should have elixir that. Not much we can do about it. We can't use Hyper Voice on it. We're gonna have to go for the Dragon Pulse. Let's see, this thing has high special defense. That's the only, oh, it's burning us. That's bad news. I don't like that. Um, the good news is it doesn't really affect our, oh, and it has pressure. Oh, yikes. It probably has Levitate, so I think we have to go to Surf now. It doesn't affect our attack the way it normally would, because we're all special attack over here, a regular attack, but still, it's gonna do one tenth damage each turn, which is bad. Mean look. Oh, bad. Also bad. Okay. Now, I would expect him to heal in this situation. Maybe. Even so, I definitely would not expect him to um, Will-O-Wisp again. Oh, he curses. Oh, no. <gasps> but wait, are we stuck? Oh, no. I don't think we're stuck anymore because the mean look doesn't last past death. But we took damage. We definitely have to switch out. That's okay. We can switch out. Right? We're going to go to plant for this. Oh, good. God, for a second I thought we were stuck with the curse and the mean look. I was like, we are screwed. Doesn't affect plant. That's right. We heal. See, that's why we did that. Now, also, we're just going to go for the dig. Quick attack. Okay. Not too scary. I, must, I bet that's his only attack that hurts us even. And we heal, that's good. Quick attack again. So this thing looks like a free kill. Dusk Noir, he went for 49, so this still isn't his ace Pokemon. That'll be level 50, super effective. <clears throat> now, <clears throat> now is when you expect the medicine though. So that's actually pretty good. Because if we can make him waste his medicine here, that's fine by me. In fact, I'm gonna try and let him do that. Oh, he's withdrawing it. Oh, yikes. Actually, this is annoying because um, Sludge Bomb. This is dangerous because it could have because it could explode. In which case, we need to throw back Kimberly so we can intimidate it to weaken the explosion. Um, yeah. So we can intimidate. Sludge bomb. Oh, it did so much damage. <clears throat> More damage than I would have liked. But well, we can Zen Headbutt. God, if it explodes though, we could be very screwed. We could, that would be devastating to our chances here. But Zen Headbutt could make it flinch and it's gonna do a ton of damage. I think we go for it. Please do not explode on me. Please just die. Oh boy, please flinch. Use haze, okay. Okay, so I'm actually feeling pretty good about this now because we're just faster. Um, yeah, we're good, we got this. That Jolteon is damaged, remember that. This is still, we still haven't seen his ace. We still don't know what the ace is. Whatever it may be. It could be the star after. Plant doing some work, Azumarill. 49, still not the ace. We resist, we resist. Don't know what it might have, but we do resist. Let's just go for the, now see this would be dangerous in um, modern day, because Azumaro picked up the fairy typing, but not now, not now. Let's go for a dragon claw. This would not even work on it. Double edge. Hit with recoil, okay. Let's just go ahead and do a heal. Okay, double edge again. Let it hit itself. Let it do it. Let it hurt itself. Recoil. Now we drag and fall again. Now it just does. Now Lance should just. Oh no! Go for the rain dance. Oh, no, I don't like that. Does he have more medicine? What I'm gonna do is fly to stall out the rain. Oh, he used, he did have more medicine. That's okay. Double edge, he hurts himself. I don't want the rain, I don't think. So I'm gonna keep, well, yeah, I'm just gonna keep stalling out the rain here. Numeral. I've used Aqua Ring. Okay, well, it's dead now for sure. 
And he used up his medicine, which is good. And the Weavile, that's his ace. Oh gosh. Oh, it's dangerous. We don't like it. I think Rutana, who hasn't seen play yet, is the answer though, right? Because Rutana's not affected by the dark. And we can hit it. Yeah, I think Rutana. Night Slash. Wait, no! What was I thinking? Oh! I so got that backwards. I so mixed it up in my head. Oh. I was like, we're fine! I cannot believe I just made that mistake. I was like, Psychic's not affected by Dark, but it's Dark that's not affected by Psychic. This was a terrible mistake. And on the Ace Pokemon, but you lived it anyway. Okay, so anyway. What I meant to say. Of course the Ace Pokemon is an Ice type. Something we've been afraid of the whole game. <laughs> Let's go to, uh, gosh. It's definitely going to hit us with another dark type move. It could even pursuit us. Oh God, please don't have pursuit. Oh, but it's gonna, oh no, Rutana. What have I done? This is a huge, huge mistake. This is a hu I was like, I was like, this is so easy. Oh, I thought we had a, are we, there's no way we're faster either. Cause that thing is higher level and is a speed demon in its own right. We're going to have to go to no well. There's no way if it has pursuit, it has pursuit, right? There's no way around it. Is Noelle even the right option? Kimberly could be hit by a nice type move and that would be bad. Noelle, I think you're the one. Okay, no pursuit, that's good. Night Slash, not very effective. We heal, okay. Let's go for the Toxic. Night Slash, not very effective. We Toxic, excellent. Noelle against the champion's ace Pokemon. As we, as we drew it up. Now we protect, we let the toxic build. We let the leftovers come in. Now we headbutt. Actually, headbutt's not the right option here. It tries to use its citrus berry. That might even be its own undoing. We protect. The correct answer is night slash because headbutt cannot flinch. So we may as well go for the crit, right? We've all used Night Slash. We retaliate with Night Slash. But the poison? Yes! Noel! Let's go! Does that mean Dalias is that wimpy Jolteon left? I think we have it. Full restore! Less wimpy. All I can do is quick attack. All it can do is quick attack while it's watch us dig. Plant. Plant for the victory. I think Slash feels fitting. Don't you? Oh, he goes for the... Okay, well, in that case... Let's dig. Let's dig. Let's go. You got nothing, dude. You got nothing. We heal! It misses! The dig! Oh! Ah! Oh, he has one more! Oh, I did not realize. I thought that was it. He has masquerade! Water bug. And it threw an intimidate on us. Should we? Oh, we had the intimidate. That's what I don't like. So sorry, Rutan. I almost lost you that. So Kimberly would be a great switch here because we could throw the Intimidate back at it. Ice is not so good because of the water. Noelle is just sort of taking some damage, which I don't like. Ace. Let's go, Ace. The Stun Spore. I don't like it. Hyper Voice. Air Slash. It's going to go for the Crit Flinch. It's going for Para Flinch. Yeah. All right, let's go. Full Restore. It's going for the Para Flinches. 
But now we're faster. Is the hyper voice all we needed? Not quite. He goes Stun Spore again. He's really working on that para flinch, y'all. I think we can go for the win right here. If he gets, he wants the flinch or the paralysis. Paralyzed. Oh, uh, come on. Through the paralysis. Beats the flinch. Come on, Ace. Take him down. Yes. Woo. We defeated champion Lance. But it's an art. Oh. 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 You have become truly powerful. Your Pokemon have responded to your strong and upstanding nature. As a trainer, you will continue to grow strong with your Pokemon. Oh my gosh. We did it. We freaking did it. Oh no, it's all over. If you weren't so slow. <laughs> ah, gee, it's been a while. Oh, you certainly look more impressive. Your conquest of the league is just fantastic. Your dedication, trust, and love for your Pokemon made this happen. Your Pokemon were outstanding too. Because they believed in you as a trainer, they persevered. Congratulations, Jay. Oh, let's interview the brand new champion. All right, whatever. Please, no paparazzi. Oh, wait, we haven't done the interview. Oh, no, not, not the interview. Oh, you're making him lose his focus. It's been a long time since I last came here. It's only one room behind where I stand all day, but I never visit. This is where we commemorate the League Champions for all eternity. The greatest Pokemon are also inducted here today. We witness the rise of a new League Champion. A trainer who feels compassion for a trust toward all folk. Okay, we get it. I got it. I got it. I'm amazing. Let's see him. Oh, gosh. Can you believe I almost whiffed on Rudon, you guys? I had the total brain fart right there. Kimberly! Kimberly! Let's hear it for Kimberly in the chat. Let's hear it for Kimberly. Let's hear it for Ice with a literal cannon for an arm. What? Been with us since the beginning. Yeah, Ice. All right, let's hear it. One more. Oh, oh. No, well, she who farts. She who took down Lance's ace Pokemon. Yes, Rutana. I am so sorry. I don't think Rutana did much fighting in that entire Elite Four bout, but Rutana, that other than coming in to take a smack from that Weavile, <laughs> I'm so sorry. That was not cool. Oh my gosh. Plant, who defeated the Jolteon, came in at the end, crushing it so close to becoming a Garchomp and Ace. Literal god of Pokemon himself. Look at him. Such an epic lineup. Oh, I like how I like how you can't even see Noel's face, just the butt. That's really the soul. That's really the soul of Noel, isn't it? The so well of Noel. <laughs> oh man, meanwhile, Rutana and Ace back there, they know how to pose. They're like, yeah, right here, right here. Ice got that uh, literal cannon pointed a little close to my head, a little close to my head, that's for sure, but it's okay. Oh! Victory! is ours for now anyway for now because the journey is not over friends we are champions there's no doubt but now we head to the canto section of the game either way i just want to say i'm just gonna pause i know we're not quite done this isn't the end of the journey but it is a momentous point in the journey and i'm just gonna say thank you so much to everyone who has been watching along this entire way i doubt this was your first episode right i'm sure you came in you've been with us the whole way you've seen many losses many terrible tragedies have befallen the team on our way to this point but faced with the five hardest trainers hands down we fought the entire game we didn't lose a single pokemon despite a tremendous error on my part switching in rutana on that weavile i cannot believe i did that that was terrible so bad but we did it anyway we prevailed rutana came in against the champion's ace took a hit and said i don't even care the end oh my gosh guys thank you so much for watching 
thus far. This is not the end. Don't be fooled by what it says on screen, because now we can go do the Kanto section of the game, which we are indeed going to do. Um, let's see. The end. Woo! And we're back out to the main screen. We are going to get right back into it. Oh, and the Dialga is like, it's definitely not the end, loser. Oh, here's mom. Hi, Jay, Professor Elm told me that he has something to give you. Fantastic. Um, let me see something real quick here. Okay, okay. Well, you guys, I think this is a perfect spot to end the episode. Oh my gosh. If you haven't left a like on the video, do it for the champions. Do it for the champions that are this team. They are amazing. They crushed it today. Really, really well done by the entire team. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, don't forget to leave a comment. We're going to be heading into Kanto soon, so we're going to be catching tons of new Pokemon for uh, to name after you guys. <sighs> what an episode. What an episode. My heart was pounding. I don't know about yours, but I was I was stressing out over here. Thank you for hitting that subscribe button as well and that bell if you want to make sure that you get the notifications. We do premieres, so you know you don't want to ever miss those. You guys are pretty familiar with the schedule, though I'm sure at this point. Thanks again. Oh man, next time uh, we're, next time we're gonna be in Kanto. It's gonna be awesome. We're gonna start taking on those gym leaders, and I will uh, I'll see you there. Until then. Hey, before we go, just want to give a shout out to all of our amazing patrons over on Patreon. Abby, Mondin, Adrian, Shishitano, Afropunk, Annalena, Ort, Brad Johnson, Brianna Bouchard, Cheyenne, Dakota Valentine, Dana Guest, Eduardo Bravo, Emerald Phoenix, Gamer Zylia, Gregory Lee, Jacob Rosh, Jade Culture, James Buzanel, Joanna Ashcroft, Karen Choi, The Very Not Lazy, Lacey Nielsen, Lauren Alexandra, Luxpa92, Madison Wolf, Mats Frulis, Momo East, Nicole Cox, Rachel Pierce, Rashiba, Romy Osterheld, Stacy, Yale Ezer, Zane Emerson, and Zero Four. 12. Thank you all so much for your support on Patreon. If you would like to uh, see your name on the wall of things right here, you can head over to patreon.com slash supercarlingaming. Thanks again. Spork.